So we got some stuff to do here. First thing we're going to do is we're going to get rid of this pretty gold amp. Because there is one more amp. Got to check it out. It doesn't sound super interesting. But the Caveman Club does look pretty neat. Yeah, that's pretty dangerous. I just wish these reskins... Well... I kind of wish they were more than just reskins. Like, the other amps did something, but they don't. So we got a mission to do, but before we get that done, there are some dead drops to grab on this particular part of the city, and we're going to just get those right quick. May as well, right? The last three dead drops in this half of Numeray, so let's get those done. Here's a new thing, though. These guys can show up now. But you've seen that fight before, so let's just get to the good part. You can kind of cheese those by getting up high somewhere. Doesn't always work as well as that did. They can knock you down pretty easily if you're not careful, but it sometimes works pretty well. Sometimes. Uh, the improved thrusters are... They're, they're really nice. That's easily the best upgrade from the last batch we got. I mean, precision's neat. The car jump's kind of neat, but thrusters are, are the standout here. Audio surveillance of Joseph Bertrand, file B146. What kind of lemon are you trying to sell me, Doctor? The transfer device works precisely as designed. We're seeing an 86% power exchange rate between individual conduits. But what you're trying to do... I'm trying to turn a profit, Doctor. Your fancy machines cost money. Splitting the power stream among multiple recipients is dangerous. The results could be highly unstable. As long as it works, we're in business. Make it work. So here's another thing that can happen now. Um, the Militia and LaRoche's dudes can get into scrapes like this. Should probably, you know, intervene or something. It's not a great idea to have an RPG shootout. That could get a little nasty. Let's just, yeah. I wish the other amps at least had a different sound effect when you hit the guys with it. Oh well. They're they're just reskins. Wish they were more. What are you gonna do? Remember this park? Let's go back there because there is a dead drop flying around. Fellas, come come on. I'm trying to I'm trying to listen to this den drop. This is very rude. I mean, I've never bothered these guys when they shoot a bird down and listen to a message that it had attached to it. That's totally happened. You can't say it hasn't. Y you don't know. That that could just be a common pastime in Numeray. Listening to bird messages or something. I don't know. People in the south are weird. I can hear you, you know. You're, you're gonna hurt Cole's feelings. He's a very sensitive man. It's a good thing the dead drops don't, like, vanish or something. Another one down the street. Yeah, I need a waypoint. I could get completely turned around walking a block. Better safe than sorry. This is a very confusing city you live in. I paid a visit to the First Sun's dorms where the Wehrmacht men were housed. 
Subject 881 approached me and we took a walk. Recording follows. You seem agitated, Doctor. I figured out what Bertram has in store for you. He's going to use the transfer device, isn't he? Sorry. No, I can't say. Do you know who the conduit is? I just can't comment on this. You need to know something. The transfer procedure was never designed to split abilities among multiple recipients. I don't know what it'll do. You just got my attention. Theoretically, you'll all be overclocked, so to speak. You'll receive a portion of the true conduit's power, but your body will wear itself out trying to sustain it. You may go insane. Why are you telling me this, Doctor? Bertrand, you wouldn't like it. I'm not a brave man. But if I'm right and you and your men lose control, then I'll have far more to fear from you than Bertrand. Audio Surveillance X-04, meeting with NSA agents John White and Lucy Quo. I've been observing Cole McGrath for weeks now, and I'm starting to get a clearer picture. We're pretty antsy over here, John. What have you found? He's chaotic. He's unpredictable. Even after all this time, I still have no idea what he's going to do next. Frankly, he seems confused. I'm sorry that I can't offer more than that. I don't know, maybe all this confusion will work in our favor. Maybe it means he'll be malleable, more willing to take direction, you know? So I'll tell you, when the beast arrives, it would be a major advantage to be in control of a conduit with McGrath's abilities. Thanks for the update. Wolf and I clearly have some thinking to do. So this mission... I know the last video was a while ago. Wait, hold on. Got some healing to do. But this mission, Nyx wants to show us something. I want to heal everybody I can and lock down as many men as I can because I am really close to maximum karma for good and evil, Cole. So we're going to be maximum hero and maximum asshole until that's filled up to the max. Better watch those feet. Gators aren't the worst thing in the water these days. Too bad. Nice day for a skinny dip. Ooh. Go right ahead. I'm not stopping you. You want to tell me what this is all about? I grew up out there. It must have been rough. It's a whole other world. Only people I ever knew were thieves and crazies. And poor like you never seen. My mama was all that. Used to be. What happened next? That's what I'm gonna show you. But first, we gotta get you a boat. And these good old boys, they got a real nice boat. <laughs> Hell yeah. So Nyx can get hurt. I bet you didn't know that. I completely forgot. But she can get blown up and hurt. I don't know if she can actually die. I have to assume she probably can. Because it's a video game. But I like how if you heal her, you don't get any good karma. Whoa, hey guy. So, let's just do this the easy way. There's lots of guys in this house. Fortunately, the RPG men seem to be terrible, terrible shots today. At least, shooting me. I mean, who gives a shit if they shoot Nick? She can, you know, I can just heal her ass, but... Like them to avoid shooting me. Cole can't pulse heal himself. Yet. So I really hope I don't kill all these guys, because I would like to do a little bio-leeching. Really, really want to get to maximum karma here, because get some unlockables. 
One of them is really nice. Well, two of them are pretty nice, but one of them is extremely good. You may know what I'm talking about. Don't necessarily have to kill all these guys, but why not? Oh, wait. Oh, there. That guy got juggled. Oh, this is actually doing things. How about that? It's not incredibly common with her. Well, the AI does like to set up the little co-op moves as much as it can. Is this guy asleep? Oh, there he goes. A little slow on the reaction time there. And now he's dead. Oh, well. That's what you get. Not as much bio-leeching as I'd like. Every little bit counts. I know the way, man. I'll drive. You just enjoy the view. So you'll notice this boat does not have a health bar or anything. Yeah, we don't have to escort it or anything. Just gotta ride it. Thank you. God, because that would not be fun. Really, are escort missions ever fun? Seriously? Why is he walking like this? I don't know. I don't think he was supposed to do that. Looks goofy, though. But now it's stopped. Those are new. See the towers ahead? All right, let's take it slow. So you could precision these towers. There's some ones that are much further away. Oh, could just, you know, do this too. Look at the delicious one way the hell out here. Let's use precision. Like, barely used it at all since I got it. Well, precision is not nearly as... You don't need to use it nearly as much as you did in the last game. But they can't sink the boat. It doesn't have a health bar. Ah, oh, here we go. And now we've unlocked two of the best powers. Bolt stream and bolt recharge. These are really nice. Bolt stream is like seriously one of the best powers in the game. Cause look at it, it's a machine gun. Bolt stream is one of the reasons that I think good coal is way more fun than evil coal. This power is so great. I'm too poor to get it. I gotta stick some men. Also, we can now recharge our powers by using just normal bolts on dudes, which is a thing from the last game they brought it back. Combined with Bolt Stream, you can get your powers back pretty fast if you don't miss too much. It's very nice. Oh. It'd be really funny if I lost the ranking from doing that execution. <laughs> That'd also be terrible, but it would be hilariously terrible. Up. Oh. Kinda stuck. Uh, come on. There we go. So I gotta stick some men here. Gotta get nice and close, though. Closer than I'd like, but, you know. I need Bolt Stream, you guys. This I need this power immediately. Which means I have to play this part kind of dumb to get it. Well, to get some sticks here. Because there are a lot of propane tanks lying around you can use to blow the guys up. I'm just going to have to ignore those. Well, I guess I'll get that one. 
So they didn't notice that I wasn't on the boat, huh? Aren't these some bright men? Not, not quite. Uh, mm. I'm a good throw. Honest. Yeah, I stuck that man. Finally. Yeah, I'm doing it. It's it's happening. Three charge. Not a whole lot of spots to do that out here, as you would expect. There's generators peppered throughout, though. Sit still, you. There. All aboard, Cole. Let these dumbasses fight it out. Those swamp things are pissed. They just defended their territory. The militia won't last long out here. So we've got a second here. I think we need to take a look at good Cole's idol, because it's much more heroic now. Look at it. It's very heroic. I know. Also, all the melee here is really janky because the boat is very small. I wouldn't have it any other way. Oh. <laughs> Damn, man. They got more monsters than mosquitoes out here. Maybe that's why the militia are digging in. Trying to keep the swamp freaks out of the city. Maybe. Looks like another militia camp. Go punish these fools so we can get moving. My pleasure. Bastards. Glad I wasn't here to see this play out. Hey man, I saw some moving on the far shore. Oh great. So guess what time it is? It's let's fight the same guy in the video again time. Hooray! Let's do this really quick though. Yep, Infamous 2 has that same problem. Well, I think it's a problem of just overusing enemies like this. Cool. Leave it alone and get back in the boat. We need to get the hell out of here. Well, leave it alone. It's dead. I murdered it. I murdered the hell out of it. I killed it so hard it's not even funny. Yep, I can't wait till we're fighting a lot of the bigger, cooler enemies later in the game, like five times a video. It's gonna happen. Stay on board, man! Ain't nothing we can do but ride it out! They're tearing the boat apart! Sit tight, we almost there! What was that? A sign we're getting close. Shut your mouth and maybe it'll pass us by. What the hell was that thing? Never stuck around to get a look. Anyhow, we here. The wheel shows up ahead on foot. Nix was dead quiet as she led the way. Right out onto 
I couldn't believe it. A little slice of Empire City. Through a pained voice, Nyx described what had happened here. She told me about Bertrand with the Ray Sphere and a ring of outcasts. They were prostitutes and swamp dwellers, anybody whose death he thought would go unnoticed. Nyx watched as her family was swallowed up in the blast. Afterwards, only the two of them remained. Clearly, Nyx had been a conduit, her body capable of absorbing the Ray Sphere energy, unleashing her powers. Same thing's got to be true for that supposed human purist Bertrand. Heading back to town, I couldn't stop thinking about it. If Nyx, at the edge of the blast, was made into such a powerhouse. What about Bertrand? The guy at the dead center? I had to show that to somebody. Just to prove it was real. Figured the demon would understand. We're gonna get Bertrand next. Oh, I know. It's just that all. Look, I gotta go punch something. Been driving that damn boat too long, you know? Wait, what was that? Wait, what? Oh no! Oh no, Nick's drowned! Oh no, Nick's is dead! <laughs> got some big news! Time we <laughs> Fuck you, Infamous 2. Come on. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Really? Oh, God. Get the hell out. That is the stupidest shit. God damn it.